Welcome back. I'm Dylan Black. We've got the Ottawa House Hunt 2017 coming to find out more about what this is uh, all about. With us right now is Sue Hamid, mortgage broker and owner of Platinum Mortgages Ottawa. How are you? I'm good, thanks. Good to have you here. And Thank we've got you for Colleen Lyle. You're very welcome. Colleen is a real estate broker and team lead as well. Who are you with, Colleen? Please. I'm with Keller Williams Integrity. Keller Williams Integrity. Okay. Uh, House Hunt 2017. Okay, so Sue, this is the second year that you guys have been doing this. Uh, what exactly is House Hunt? So House Hunt is a giant scavenger hunt okay. across the Canada Centrum. And uh, participants race around the Centrum for an hour uh, solving riddles and collecting clues. And the winner of the hunt uh, actually wins a down payment on a home. Wow, that seems pretty like a pretty decent prize. It, it's pretty sense. good. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good prize. Okay, so Colleen, so we created this a couple of years back. Now, now why, why did we create this House Hunt? Um, I, it's all about giving back to the community. I'm born and raised in Ottawa and have the pleasure of working with um, so many families and have a, a, a great business and so I'm very much uh, about giving back to the community. So when we thought of uh, this idea about three years ago, it was how can we create uh, a buzz about being a realtor and a broker and a mortgage broker and yet find the best way to give back to the community. Mm -hmm. And so this event which um, I believe is the first of its kind, um, not only here in Ottawa, but also in Ontario. Mm. And it was just about how do we find the, the best way to give back. And us being both moms, uh, we found a great partnership in the SENS Campership Program, which gives back and, and we're able to put underprivileged kids to camps over the summer. Wow, okay, so the SENS are on board with this then? This, the SENS Foundation are 100% on board. Last summer, we actually went to, uh, to one of the camps where some of the uh, children were there to to benefit and they were just having a great blast weren't yeah. they and they were, and yeah. uh, it was just for some of these families this really is the one week that they get to be kids mm -hmm. because they don't they don't necessarily have the pleasures that uh, a lot of families do that's beautiful okay so not only are the, are the sense on board but a lot of other great um, organizations too absolutely we have our title sponsor is uh, Myers Hyundai of Bells Corners okay and they're a perfect fit because what do you normally do when you buy a home you usually buy a car at the same time, yeah. right? So yeah. um, sure. they're our title sponsor. <laughs> we're very happy to have them on board. Okay. Uh, and as well, you've also got, um, uh, we're going to be doing some drinking here. Let's let's talk yes. about this. <laughs> and this is a good thing. By the way, here we got the picture up from the last year here. So uh, is that how much money we raised last year? Or uh, I'm a little the, confused by that's that That's the amount of money that the uh, the winners, uh, they won $15,000 towards the down you. payment yeah. on their home. I get you. Okay, yeah. cool. And that's, I mean, that's a lot of they, cash. It, it was. And for them, uh, this was a young family uh, who wasn't really needed a new home because they had three kids and weren't really sure how they were going to pay for a down payment on the home. Mm -hmm. So there were lots of tears when we uh, when we passed out Absolutely. that check. That's yeah. a lot of fun. Okay, back to the drinking. <laughs> uh, so we've also got three brewers on board as well. Absolutely. So tell us how they're incorporated. So in this. they'll be hosting the event. Uh, they're going to be the uh, start rate of the fin of the race. So yeah. they'll be at the starting point, and all the participants will come back as we're tallying the points and all the anticipation is rising. Uh, Three Breweries is offering lots of uh, beer and, and food for, yeah. for the guests. Yeah. They've been a great sponsor and uh, we really appreciate their support yeah. as everybody here uh, is all about volunteers and donation because it is a not-for-profit event. Which is wonderful. So how do we get signed up for this? I mean what are we looking for? Families or like who, who's eligible? It, we found that last year the age range was everything from 19 to 69. Absolutely. So, really? um, so it's not only your first home but it could be an investment it could be a cottage so all you need to do is find a partner that you're ready to to get out there and have some real fun with and go mm -hmm. to ottawahousehunt.ca and uh, and register online for eighty dollars and all that money goes to help kids go to camp wow yeah okay. so it's teams of two teams of two yeah. so how many teams like there must be a maximum is, is uh, right now we we're definitely filling up last year we had we had 50 teams but we're ready due to the fact that three breweries is offering a larger space mm -hmm. we're definitely looking to put more kids into camp so we'll just keep registering that's cool just just keep going yeah. just keep going that's until right. we shut it down that, that's <laughs> wonderful okay so I'm just trying to figure out how it works then so this is going to be taking place on May 13th Saturday so bright and early or when, when would this all start so we're going to start uh, you, you come t and uh, sign in and register and get your t-shirt uh, at one o'clock and schmooze and, and maybe grab that drink that, yeah. you, that you fondly love 
and at two o'clock yeah. to three o'clock <laughs> there will be that scavenger hunt and so you will just at the at the starting line you will get the the clues and the map that Sue and I will not see. We still haven't seen it and we don't see it until the end of the day. Yeah. And so you will get a map and they have an hour to solve the clues, get the extra points, etc. You sign in at three and around 3.30, 4 o'clock we will announce the grand prize winner and then you're well, more than welcome to join us and mingle and again join some of those mm -hmm. uh, libations and food that All we right. will so, <laughs> so. So it is an afternoon event, It is an is afternoon Because a lot of these events usually are mornings and stuff like yeah. that and I don't know why we have stuff on Saturday and Sunday morning some days you know <laughs> it's nice to, some days some weekends uh, you know and it's nice to have something where you don't have to get up super early and you can absolutely just take your time at your leisure so how then do you win like what what is the, the, the deciding factor so the deciding factor is based on a point system uh, last year we had a series of questions and also bonus points so mm -hmm. the winners from last year actually won on bonus points alone and the bonus points were achieved by taking different selfies and hashtagging them on social media. Oh, really? Okay. And that uh, the winning team did a fantastic job at uh, using as many bonus points as they could, yeah. and it actually put them over the top at the end of the day. Do we know this, the hashtag already? Well, we were hashtagging like Ottawa House Hunt last year, yeah. Oh, yeah. so on uh, Twitter and Facebook, and uh, doing you know cool things like take a picture with as many people as you can, um, so they would gather 12 people in the center room and just take That's a fun. selfie with them. <laughs> or, or even it was something as simple as find someone with uh, black nail polish. Exactly. Oh, or wow. yeah. Right? Or a gentleman it sends jerseys. Yeah. Right? right. So. Well, uh, we've got the Ottawa House Hunt 2017 happening Saturday, May 13th in the afternoon, which is beautiful. And uh, Sue and Colleen, thank you very much for being here today and helping out. Of course, the kids. Thank, thank you, you very much. Thank Thanks. you. Best of luck. Poutine Fest is coming. Ooh, that's fun. Will we be eating some poutine on air next? Les Gagne, possibly. Uh, it's coming up on daytime.